The fire began Thursday afternoon at the Northeast Operations Center of San Diego Gas and Electric. The building in an Escondido industrial zone has 24 storage units filled with lithium-ion batteries, and one of them caught fire. Fire Chief Tyler Batson said this afternoon there was no longer any visible smoke or fire. So there's every indicator that that runaway lithium-ion battery fire inside that container uh, reached basically it burned itself out. So that's what we're hoping. Now we're in the process of confirming that. The surrounding area was evacuated and three schools canceled classes out of what the school district called an abundance of caution. Lithium ion battery fires can't be extinguished with water. They can result in explosions and they're unpredictable as they can seem to go out but reignite. Fire authorities are often limited to cooling nearby structures with water so the fires don't spread. The best industri industry practices uh, that, that all the subject matter experts have agreed on when they were out there yesterday advising is if it's in a safe area or you can make it a safe area, then you let it burn itself out. Battery storage structures like this are dangerous when they catch on fire because they emit flammable hydrogen gases. Batson says the good news is the gases are lighter than air, so they flow skyward and disperse quickly. He says the storage units in the building were about the size of an RV with racks inside holding cases of lithium-ion batteries. And if you can think of maybe a suitcase stacked on top of each other, each suitcase is full of uh, lithium-ion batteries that are about the size of a motorcycle battery, maybe uh, kind of the size of a brick. Some communities are fighting to prevent the creation of lithium-ion battery storage facilities in their area. The Escondido City Council recently passed a resolution opposing battery storage buildings in the city. Thomas Fudge, KPBS News.